I've just come back from uh, a week in Bangladesh and I think when people talk about going on charity trips like this, everyone has, you know, you can tell that the person's had some sort of kind of seminal moment. But I, I really did to see basically the situation out there and then the response that Oxfam's had. I travelled with Oxfam because I wanted to see for myself firsthand how effectively is the money being used. And I have to say, I was blown away by just what great value for money the people that donate to Oxfam are getting. But the headline that surprised me is just how extreme the poverty was. Oxfam itself has had to come up with a new phrase of talking about people being ultra poor because poverty doesn't class it anymore. And ultra poor is people on 60p a day or less. But no one's sat there feeling sorry for themselves. They just need a tiny bit of fairness. And I think that what Oxfam is doing a great job of doing. It's not handouts, it's not charity, it's just helping people that have been disfranchised for no reason that they're in control of to actually get a fair crack at it. I saw where a riverbank had been eroded two kilometres in one year. The monsoon rains come with such force because of, of climate change. But you see people finding ways to tackle it rather than accept it, they'll find ways to become more resilient to it. The situation may be tough, but there will be a way to handle it. But the thing that was the most exciting in terms of its long-term potential is building in the resilience in the communities by giving the communities the ability to understand what it is that they're facing in terms of the consequences of climate change, about how they can increase the price that they get for the crops that they grow. Really simple, practical things that allow people to be in control of their own destiny because Oxfam has not been turning up and telling people what to do. Oxfam and its partners has been there facilitating the community find its own voice and solve its own problems. Well, what I take away from trips like this is you will never see people achieving more with less. And that's an incredible thing. My job as running a business is to make sure that we're getting the best return on whatever resources that, that we have. And here you've got communities with so little but achieving so much, the work that is being done and the results that are being achieved are absolutely transformational and represent a great investment in human betterment.